Like that, so. yeah. We didn't have 90s day, it was decade day, and some people tried to come for me and tell me that 90s was not the best decade when clearly it was. Yeah, Do you see these cartoons? You're going to be more biased to whatever the decade you is. It's just like your child. Like You're going to be more biased to your child, even, no matter how bad or how good they may be. Best cartoon. You're going to be more biased. You're going to think your child is the best child in the world because it's your child. Just like your decade. You're going to think it's the best decade in the world because it's your decade. Crate. Open up the snack crate. Open up the snack crate. <laughs> Let's just keep trying there. Okay, snack crack. So y'all know how we usually do. Put this away. There's children at the park. It says Shalom, so I'm going with Jerusalem, Jerusalem snacks. Morocco. Morocco. We're going to put the little Morocco, Morocco flag somewhere right here. Oh, fun facts. So I'm going to do the fun facts. So fun facts from Morocco. Morocco. Morocco, throw up the rock. <laughs> Fun facts. Green tea sweetened with sugar and mint leaves, also known as Berber whiskey, is the most popular beverage in Morocco. So green tea sweetened with sugar and mint leaves. Berber whiskey. Morocco is the only Islamic. Yeah, Berber. Berber. Morocco is the only Islamic country in which women's rights are preserved in the constitution to ensure their utmost importance in society. That's good. Yeah. Round of applause. I probably could sound a bit, but that's good too. Marrakesh is commonly referred to as the Red City because of the red and pinkish hues that flood the walls of the city. Ang Ar Argan. Argan oil, argan oil, the popular hair care product is produced solely in Morocco. Really? As the argan tree is in, in a epidemic, endemic to that region. Mm. So I'll put a picture of that up there too. The traditional form of Moroccan housing, a riard? Right? Riard. Often boasts two or more stories and features a garden or a courtyard in the middle. Okay, so what we're gonna start with? It's in West Africa. The kingdom of Morocco is located in West Africa. Neighboring both the Mediterranean Sea and the Atlantic Ocean. Okay. And it's home to over 36 million people. And well, I'm not gonna really read no more. So y'all have enough fun facts about Morocco. I should so probably use some contacts. Let's okay, have. So you gonna, you gonna, you gonna, you gonna read it? Yeah. Let's have the Conicole. Okay. Yeah, I'm ready. To eat. Con so I'm probably, I'm probably ready more than usual. The crunchy cone-shaped corn. You know this? Jeez. This looks like um, bugles. 
The crunchy cone-shaped corn snacks are coated generously with a savory dusty of cheesy goodness. A savory dusting of cheesy goodness. Like bugles. It just smells like cheese. You smelled it already? Uh, I, I, it has cheese on it. Tastes like a bugle. Ew. Mm, it's good. You know I did not bring a bottle of water. It's cool. We got water in the top. Yeah, we didn't bring a bottle of water. We're we'll gonna have to use our saliva. Bruh. But, you already know. When we do the snack break, we want more rude. Right I'm now, not I'm trying to be rude. Yeah, but if it's in you, it don't have to be on you, y'all. If it's in you, then that's Come on, you're you trying to eat a whole meal. Yeah, because I am hungry. I'm gonna have to it's good. not nasty, I just wanna keep eating it. Leader chips, kebab. Leader chips. Oh, no, it's gonna be a kebab. Setting the standard of all other savory snacks, these potato chips have a unique crunch that will keep you coming back for more. We've included either kebab or cheese and onion flavor. You don't have to smell it. I do you have to it. smell it, well then let me get my own chips. I have to smell it. Don't! Yeah. Now, what attitude for me? Mmm, chocolate. And all you get, it's called Gen Genova. Genova, double cream. At this point, I will need my bottle of water. That was, what did that one taste like to you? Mm, the second one. Good A chocolate, a chocoholic's dream coming true. Rich, spongy layers of chocolate cake with a ooey gooey feeling of smooth chocolate ganache. Okay. Well, I guess it wouldn't matter. Um, Y'all know she's pregnant now? Yeah, and they hurt. Yeah. And the colder the weather is, the more they hurt. I'm not gonna put my fingers on it, baby. I'm gonna bite it. Okay. I think it's a lot more sanitary. To bite it? You can just put your fingers on it. My hands, I came from work. Oh. hands in the side of the car. I'm putting on. But that's good. Mm, looks like it's brown. Mm. Yeah, this, this is good. Okay, I'm gonna read the next one. Bite number two. Worthy. Back. Sandwichy. Sandwichy. Chalk. Oh, I see. Excellent. Excellent. Sandwich. Huh? The perfect on-the-go snack. This delicious treat features two sponge cakes sandwiched together by a, a layer of rich milk chocolate. So I say like sponge over there. Good. It feels like oh. No, it does not. It feels like nope. It feels like Boston. It's like a Boston cream pie. It tastes sort of like bread to me. Say what? I don't really care for that there one. There you go. I don't really care for that one. That's the. Mmm, they got go. We do that last. It's watermelon flavor. Ugh, yuck. Yep. You gotta do it for the kale. Okay, they got another chocolate. Why are we doing all the chocolate right now? Tabago. Okay. Tab Tabago. These are wafers. They look like they're lime flavor. Coconut. Or these are acorns. This, my paper say Tajigo. It was Tajigo. No. This is a Vito. I know, but it's a G on here. here. Perfect for a hot day. These crispy vanilla wafer sandwiches are filled with nutty hazelnut spread. You gotta use the restroom or something? Nope. Use them tiger teeth. Ooh. How did it look? You got separated. Mmm. 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 Spain? Mmm. 
inside the kebab. Might be coming for you. That's good. That's really good. Mm-hmm. Let's have another. No. Let's, Let's share go to another. the next one. Nope. No. Let's go to the next one. Let's do. Oh, that's what the brand. Called? Yeah. Henry's. Henry's. Okay. These Circuit. pleasantly. Get away from here. Bruh. These pleasantly plain biscuits have a delightful crunch and go great with a steamy cup of tea or coffee after dinner. Mm -hmm. Okay. I can't. It's soft. Oh. It don't taste bad. Baby fathers. Just, oh, no, that's good. It don't taste bad. It's just soft. A soft Shout cookie. out my baby fathers down there. Our right, team rich. It tastes like it's old. In the in the comment section. This is not my space. How about in the chat? My space? My space? Yeah. You went way back. Pyramidal. Pyramidal. Uh, pyramidal. Drawing inspiration from the neighbors to the far east, these pyramid shaped wafers are packed to the max with rich chocolatey cream. Each bite will send you to a cocoa filled afterlife. They like chocolate. Mostly everything has been chocolate. It's hard to open though. I told you you used them tiger teeth. It sure do. It shall do, y'all. It shall do, do. Give me a bite. double the fun. This inviting snack highlights layer of dark chocolate a cream between a crisp vanilla wafer. I've been getting better with chocolate later. I guess I'm pretty too. Mmm. Mmm. That's good too. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's all I just the bob. Everything's good. Yeah. Everything's been pretty good. Okay. We are more done. Lickest duets. So which one you wanted the more of? This oh, one? Yeah. I already know, because as soon as we're done. Yeah, let me put it. Okay. I'm sorry. Bleakest Duist. Bleakest Duist. Okay. Delicious vanilla cookie sandwiching a smooth layer of sweet cream. What could possibly be better? This? Oh, that's look like a cracker. Yeah, with vanilla flavor. Oh, weird. It looked like the United States is the only one that had a lot of fat and sugar in there. Mmm. That's really good. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That was good. Here goes the gum. That probably oh, yeah, spit out. Now. There you go. Mm -mm. I don't like watermelon flavor well, stuff. You gotta do it for the can. Go ahead. Yeah, you can have this afterwards. Babe, well, I'm gonna chew the gum. Okay. Yeah, just taste it. No, uh, 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 uh. we already had that one. You gotta wait till you get finished. Baby. Okay, you gotta read this one. Okay. It's watermelon chewing gum. No, I ain't what it said on there. It might be a little It's different. flash watermelon originating in Calabasca, Sisera, 1959. Flash chewing gum has been a staple in Moroccan society ever since. We've provided our flavor, fruity, tangy flavor variety. Okay, you make the deal, you know what Break that in height. No, I'm not sure you just a little bit. Okay. Yeah, but I'm gonna go like that. Nope. Show don't. Nope. 
You gotta just chew it. I did, I tasted it on my tongue. It tastes just like our watermelon candy. I don't like mm -hmm. it. That's not bad. That's it's just, you it's like less, watermelon candy. No, I just don't buy watermelon candy. But it's it's. Like, comment, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Now eat some snacks with us while we're doing these so y'all don't feel left out. So make sure you chewing while we chewing. And with that being said, we gone. This is you the know, Moroccan snack crate. I love you Thank y'all for watching. Yeah.